Here's how the villains operate van dragging. It's early morning in a city back street. These CCTV cameras are guarding the loading bay doors that serve a major electrical goods store. The real hustlers arrive for the start of today's scam. Jess scribbles two identical notes. One note is stuck to each loading bay door. So why do the team want delivery drivers to ring their number? Here's the answer. The team are going to park in the best place to observe the comings and goings in the street. The boys will wait out of sight while Jess keeps a lookout for any arrivals at the targeted loading bay. If a van does turn up, hopefully the driver will read Jess's sign and call her. She'll then send in Alex and Paul after convincing the driver to hand over the goods to her warehouseman. The hustler's van is parked here, enabling Jess to keep surveillance. Alex and Paul unload their trolley. They will keep out of sight here. But the plan might come unstuck. Jess doesn't know it yet, but this is her delivery van arriving. It's early and it's turned the wrong way up the dead end street. This is dangerous. It's gonna pass right by Alex and Paul's hiding place. The driver will be looking everywhere for his loading bay and if he spots the boys hiding, it will blow their cover. The delivery van comes back down and now Jess realises what's happening. Did the driver see Paul and Alex? Oh yes, he's pulled up right next to the door. going for his mobile. Jess must now play her role. Hello, how can I help? Yeah, hi, we've got delivery for you. We're outside, Jess. Oh, right, OK, we're actually having problems with the door. Are you outside right now? Yeah. Right, I'm going to send a couple of guys round just to help. Thank OK, you. they're on the way now. Thanks, bye. Boys? Come in. Ready, go for it. The driver is taken in and unloads his cargo, £10,000 worth of widescreen TVs. Meanwhile, the boys have come out of hiding. They are about to find out if they were seen or not. You for 24, mate? Yeah. We're waiting for a locksmith. Be about half an hour. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, we got to get the doors around. Guys, what we got? Around. Is that it? The driver's fallen for it. He couldn't have seen them. Jess can afford a sigh of relief. Would you want anyway? Paul signs for the delivery and joins Alex in loading up their booty. You back? Yeah. Go to the other side. Hang on a minute, mate. Wait, wait. Incredibly, the driver hasn't suspected a thing. Not the crudely written note, nor the phone call, or even Alex and Paul decked out in fluorescent jackets and homemade security IDs. His load has been hijacked, and he doesn't even know it. I'll have this one. Jesse, we're ready for our van. Well, how many? Yeah, well, 
Let's have a look. Way. Nice. I'll get the doors, yeah. <laughs> It's time to load up and get away. This was no violent robbery, but a terrifyingly simple con trick that has stolen £10,000 worth of goods under the unsuspecting gaze of CCTV and under the nose of a professional delivery driver.